Adelaide Football Club coach Phil Walsh has died in his home at Summerton Park on the early morning of July the 3rd, 2015. During the 1980s, he had played football with three clubs, Collingwood, Richmond and the Brisbane Bears in the Victorian Football League, now known as the Australian Football League. After his playing career, he became a fitness coordinator and a senior runner for the Geelong Football Club in 1996. In 1999, he moved on to the Port Adelaide Football Club as assistant coach under Mark Williams. He was part of the Powers Premiership success in 2004. Walsh then moved to the West Coast Eagles as assistant coach under John Walsfold in 2009. However, he returned to Port Adelaide in 2014 as assistant coach in midfield strategy. Hello everyone, particularly our fans, the 19th man. First of all, I'd just like to say how honoured I am to be your senior coach. On October the 7th, 2014, Walsh was appointed senior coach for the Adelaide Football Club after the sacking of Brenton Sanderson. In the 2015 AFL season, he had coached 12 games for the Adelaide Crows. He led the Crows with 7 wins and 5 losses. On July the 5th, 2015, Phil Walsh was found dead in his home at Summerton Park. His 26-year-old son was responsible for murder and was arrested and taken into custody. Walsh's wife was taken to hospital, suffering from cuts in her leg. The AFL, Adelaide Football Club and fans across Australia were mourning the death of Walsh. Tributes were flown as many fans hanged scarves outside their homes. The AFL have also confirmed that the match between Adelaide and Geelong will be cancelled to honour Phil Walsh. Instead, both Adelaide and Geelong will receive two points. Walsh will be remembered on the impact he had made for our game.